Today we're going to show you how to update the force crack and trolling motor, trolling motor foot pedal, and trolling motor remote using the Active Captain app. For this process, you will need a compatible smartphone or tablet with the Active Captain app installed and the remote control connected to the trolling motor. In this video, we will be using an Apple iPhone, but the process is similar on other Apple and Android devices. First, we will need to power on the trolling motor. Then, power on the remote control. Select Menu on the remote. Now, select Settings. Trolling Motor. Wi-Fi. Mode. And then Active Captain. Select Setup. Then select Name. Select Review. A preset name will be displayed for the trolling motor's Wi Fi. Select the right arrow to confirm the Wi Fi name. You can also create a new name for the trolling motor's Wi Fi. Now, set or edit the password for the trolling motor's Wi-Fi network. This password must contain at least eight characters. It is recommended to use a combination of upper and lowercase letters, numbers, and symbols. Then, select the check mark using the right arrow to confirm the password. You will now need to connect to your compatible smart device for your force crack and trolling motor's Wi-Fi network. Locate the Wi-Fi network in your Wi-Fi settings. Enter the password and select Join. Now navigate back to the Active Captain app. Select the Boat Apps tab. The Active Captain app will scan the trolling motor and check for any updates. Connecting to the trolling motor for the first time will also register the product to your Garmin account. The Active Captain app will download any updates for the force crack and trolling motor. Home or local Wi-Fi may be needed if cellular signal is too weak to download the updates. A message will display under My Marine Device that will read software updates ready for transfer once the download is complete. Connect back to your trolling motor Wi-Fi. The updates will automatically install to your force crack and trolling motor. Ensure that your trolling motor foot pedal and remote control are powered on and connected before beginning the update. Then turn off the trolling motor. Power the trolling motor back on. Ensure all of the green lights on the display panel are turned on. The speed wheel on the display panel will now begin to flash green. This indicates that your trolling motor, foot pedal and remote control are being updated. An in-progress software update is also indicated by a purple light on the foot pedal and a software loading screen on the remote control. The trolling motor will take an extended period of time to update. Please do not power down the trolling motor while updates are in progress. Powering down during this process can damage the trolling motor. And that's it, you have now updated the software on your force crack and trolling motor, trolling motor foot pedal, and trolling motor remote. Thanks for watching. For more help, please visit marinesupport.garmin.com.